And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Talk about an absolutely gorgeous day today. Plenty of sunshine throughout the viewing area this afternoon, but it didn't do much to warm things up. In fact, temperatures today were nearly 15 degrees cooler than they were yesterday at the same time. We had a high temperature so far today, 59 degrees. That is about 7 degrees below average for this time of the year. And right now, we find ourselves at the same temperature. Northeasterly winds around 3 miles per hour. There is your cold front. We had the cold front roll across the region late last night, early this morning. Since then, the northeasterly winds flowing in, gusting as high as 25 miles per hour at times, driving temperatures lower. This morning, we only fell to about 45 degrees in West Lafayette. Tonight, it'll be considerably cooler throughout the viewing area. 59 currently in Fowler, 58 even Logansport, 61 currently in Morocco. But for Morocco, as well as all of Newton and Jasper counties, we're actually looking at, yes, a frost advisory, the first of the season. A frost advisory in effect for parts of Newton and Jasper counties that goes until 10 a.m. Eastern time on Friday, begins 2 a.m. Eastern time early tomorrow morning. Temperatures are expected to fall into the mid to upper 30s throughout much of the region. We'll have plenty of moisture here at the surface. But notice, we're not the only ones dealing with a frost advisory. In fact, this advisory extends eastward out towards parts of Ohio, Pennsylvania, West Virginia. So we're going to be dealing with the chilly conditions. And it's all thanks to the same core of high pressure that drove those temperatures lower today. Right now, centralized just along Iowa as well as Illinois. That high will actually kick its way eastward overnight tonight. And it's actually going to help drive temperatures a little bit higher for tomorrow, but the overnight hours keeping skies crystal clear up until early tomorrow morning when we do see that low level moisture roll into the region and that's when we could be looking at that potential for frost early Friday morning. So if you do have any of those plants outdoors you want to keep safe, try to cover them up, bring them inside for the night because temperatures will be warming up and actually looking at a pretty nice forecast going ahead. Your snapshot forecast this evening, another beautiful harvest photo from Wade McCutcheon. Check out that gorgeous sunset there. Temperatures just as nice, 53 degrees degrees by 7 down to around 44 by midnight will bottom out at 39 in West Lafayette. Some of us may fall lower than that 37 year overnight low temperature in Logansport. Tomorrow plenty of sunshine expected throughout the afternoon. A southerly wind flow moving in. That's going to help drive temperatures back up into the mid to upper 60s. Well, a high temperature 67 degrees on Friday, Saturday back up to 74. We even had a high temperature of 76 degrees on Sunday with a cold front sagging in across the region. Stalling out won't do much to cool things off. In fact, temperatures are only expected to warm up 79 Monday, Tuesday. Believe it or not, we're looking at a high temperature of 80 degrees. Yeah, I like to believe that. That's a good temperature yeah. for me. I know you like this chilly weather, but <laughs> I'm a fan. Yeah. Not so much. All right, we got basketball in sports.